morning everyone i would just like to share that my maternal grandparents were one of my first inspirations for their simple living and high thinking attitude and my grandfather always told me many stories which had a very deep moral value today i would like to read out one of those stories to all of you in a small town of punjab india lived a landlord with his wife they owned a very big area of land and a big herd of cattle but they had no children as they grew older it became difficult to manage the field work so they hired a cowboy to look after their cattle this young lad would bathe and help the cattle graze on the grassland the lady of the house would provide the boy with the afternoon lunch in the afternoon the cowboy sat down before his meal and started praying upon lord rama requesting him to have the first morsel so that he could then savored his meal so lord rama appeared and had the meal with him this continued for a couple of days when finally lord rama's wife mata sita asked her husband that where did he disappear every day at lunch time lord rama narrated the incident of the cowboy Sita ji was so impressed with this cowboy's devotion that she decided to accompany Lord Rama and so Lord Rama with his wife Mata Sita met the boy and shared the meal with him soon it happened that Lord Rama Mata Sita were also followed by rama's brother lord lakshman and finally even lord hanuman ji joined all the three and they used to share the meal with this cowboy at first the cowboy managed to share the meal and distribute it for each one of them but slowly it got harder as the number of people increased so he decided to ask for more food and initially the landlady thought that it was just the story that the cowboy said about lord rama himself visiting and having meal with his family she thought it was just a cover up by this cowboy to hide his hunger but when this continued for a long time she grew suspicious so she decided to ask her husband to quietly check on the cowboy's activities so one day this cowboy was quietly followed by his master and when the cowboy sat down to have his meal he started praying again and as soon as he prayed the landlord was awe stricken indeed lord rama was here with his family his wife mata sita his brother lord lakshman and lord hanuman and he rushed to seek their blessings too so friends from this story which was narrated by my grandpa to me when i was a young girl he only taught me one thing that my child remember it does not matter in life which clan which family or what financial status you come from it is more important to do your true karma to be a good human being so that god himself comes and blesses you
So I always have remembered this all my life and I believe that positive karma do bring the Lord himself to bless you. Thank you. Have a lovely week.